Now, your exclusive seven storm team forecast. A gorgeous evening out there across the region. Yes, we do have a few high clouds starting to strut their stuff across the region, but outside of that, the sleep tight weather cam will stay dry, at least on the view across Quincy and the tri states. We will see skies become mostly clear as we head through the night ahead. Currently, here's what we have for you temperature wise 83 here in Quincy, lower to middle 80s from Des Moines, out towards Bloomington, back down towards St. Louis. A warm day, no doubt. But check out these dew point readings. The lower the number, the less moisture content, aka the less muggy it feels. So as you watch here, we see readings in the 50s, even the lower 40s up towards Chicago, indicating a dry air mass. And that's due to an area of high pressure up over the Great Lakes region, bringing in some east winds and some dry air funneled in across the tri-states. Now, get out and enjoy it tonight because by later tomorrow on into the weekend, that's all going to be gone. We're going to see the hot, sticky stuff move back in across the region. A nice night out there tonight. We'll see lows somewhere in the mid-60s. More muggy weather, though, for us as we head into tomorrow afternoon. Temperatures warm into the 90s starting on Friday, the first day of summer, and then we'll be in the lower 90s with that humidity on through the weekend and probably on into next week as well. Currently 84 in Keokuk, 86 in Macomb, 86 in Hannibal. It's 80 out in Kirksville, 82 up in Fort Madison. Locally 83 degrees here in Quincy with a partly sunny sky. The light east wind right now at 6 miles an hour. The pressure is currently steady. Our high today, 83 degrees. Our current reading, the low was 62. The record high for the date, 105 degrees. Set way back in 1930-something. I went by the graphic so fast I can't tell you. But it was a long time ago, and it was really hot. So here we go. Here's that high pressure system back up over Michigan right now. You get that flow coming down out of the east, bringing in the drier air, keeping our temperatures in the lower 80s. But by later on tomorrow, we'll see the winds shift to the south and we'll get the Gulf moisture coming in and we will also see temperatures start to spike up into the upper 80s. Partly cloudy skies across the tri-states right now. No rain across the region. Temperatures tonight fall back through the 70s into the middle 60s for overnight lows. We'll bottom out somewhere around 65 degrees or so here in Quincy as we head on into tomorrow afternoon through the 70s through the lower and middle 80s somewhere right around 87 or 88 for an afternoon high tomorrow for tonight 65 for low with a few clouds out there some stars as well winds light out of the southeast 5 to 15 for tomorrow 88 for a high a slim storm chance as we go on through the daytime hours it'll be hot though and humid with those south southeast winds ushering in the moisture 10 to 15 miles an hour for friday First day of summer, 91 degrees. Overnight lows in the lower 70s on Friday night into Saturday. Storm chance on Saturday with a high of 92 degrees. Then by Sunday, we're dry, it looks like. Partly cloudy skies. Highs in the lower 90s. And a dry period of weather for the most part on through Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday. And you might want to take note there, Carol, I know you're a summer weather fan. How about those temperatures on Tuesday and Wednesday? you got to love that, don't you? No, 95 is uh, no, uh, at least 10 degrees too warm for me. Wow. That but is, you know uh, what? Yeah. I don't get a vote. So. No, <laughs> no, we sort of got to deal with it, don't we? We do. All right. Thanks, Mike. Uh -huh. and